When I was elected in 2007, the first call that I got after my mom called me to make sure it was true <laughs> was from DeVos Porter. And when I got to the Capitol, the first real lesson I learned was from DeVos Porter. There was a bill that was in front of us, and I had come from the city of Atlanta where I served as deputy city attorney, and so my instinct was to vote for Atlanta's interest. But DeVos looked at me and said, you're not just an Atlanta representative. You are a Georgia state representative. That is a profound responsibility. And that responsibility stayed with me. And that responsibility led me to run for leader, and that responsibility brings me to this podium because there is not a person that I know of in the state of Georgia who understands more fundamentally what it means to be a Georgian. DeBose Porter has learned, he has evolved, and he has led the state for more than 30 years. He has taken the lessons that he learned about homosexuality from the gay marriage fight and evolved his beliefs. He understands more about women's rights than a lot of the women who vote down at the Capitol. This is a man who tells us not just to think about the environment, but to live every day as though the environment is our legacy to our children. That is the person that we need leading the state party. I have a great deal of respect for all of the candidates running today, but I am here today and standing here this morning because I believe that our future is as much about money as it is about vision. Because the money is irrelevant if we don't have a place to go. And that place, that place is beyond the confines of the metro Atlanta area. It is in Tennessee. It's driving that completely unfathomable distance from Columbus to Jessup, which apparently doesn't have a roadway. <laughs> but it's having someone who knows the back roads and the back ways, who's been in politics long enough to understand it, but not so long that he fears it. And that is why I stand today to put into nomination my friend, my colleague, my hero, Representative DeBose Porter. Thank you.